Labour needs to make sure that environment is at the heart of our politics, which means not just talking a good game on climate change and the environment, but actually making the policies that matter. And in the eight years when Labour was in power in Scotland, you saw a massive increase going into public transport, into walking and cycling projects, giving people better alternatives to being stuck in traffic jams. I think the difficulty over the next few years is we've got a government that talks the talk at Holyrood, with the SNP saying things that sound green, but actually in practice, cutting back on money going to buses, uh, not committing to the borders railway line to give us a, an early start. And on really basic things, just simple promises like saying they'd put renewables in every school building, absolutely sunk without trace that policy. I've asked Alex Salmond and SNP ministers about these policies regularly in the chamber, pressing them for action. And we don't have deadlines, we don't have targets. And the SNP were really upfront about wanting to tackle climate change with 3% annual cuts, the first thing they dumped when they got into government. So myself and Labour colleagues will be working with other parties and all the campaigners from SCIAF, from Oxfam, the Church of Scotland, all the big environmental NGOs like Friends of the Earth, Greenpeace, WWF, to make sure that we have a really strong climate change bill in the Parliament and that we have the investment to match. That's how we're going to tackle climate change.